you've added some content to your ePortfolio and you'd like others to see it, you need to publish it. Now, as you've been working in your ePortfolio, you've probably noticed this yellow warning message at the top of the screen that says your changes have not been published yet. You'll notice that next to that warning message, there is a blue button that allows you to publish the changes on just the page you are viewing. This can be helpful if you'd like to build and launch each page of your ePortfolio one at a time, or want to publish updates to one page while you're working on editing other pages in your ePortfolio and would like to keep that work behind the scenes. However, what I'm going to show you how to do is publish all of the changes in your ePortfolio at once to save you a lot of time. In order to do that, just open the drop down menu in the upper right hand corner of your ePortfolio, and you want the second item down on this list, which is Publish Pages. Once you select that, you'll notice that it opens up an outline of all of the pages in your ePortfolio. And any page that's marked with a red draft icon is a page that has an unpublished change on it. My ePortfolio here has never been published, so all of the pages are marked as draft. In order to publish these pages all at once, all you need to do is make sure that any page that you would like to publish is checked with the green check mark. If there's one page that you're not ready to publish yet, you can uncheck it. And then down in the bottom right hand corner of the screen, you can select publish. Now, if this is your first time publishing your ePortfolio, it's going to prompt you one more time with your permission settings to make sure that any viewers who you would like to be able to see your work are added as viewers to your ePortfolio. If your permission settings look the way that you'd like them to, you can select save settings at the bottom of the screen and this will save those settings and publish all of the work in your ePortfolio. Now that yellow warning message at the top of the screen has gone away, and if I switch over from edit mode to the published view of my ePortfolio, it looks exactly like the ePortfolio I've been working on. However, if I were to go back to edit mode and change something about this page of my ePortfolio, for example, if I change the font in my text box here, now you'll notice that that yellow warning message comes back. It says your changes have not been published yet. If I go and look at the published view of the ePortfolio, the old font is still there. I would need to publish changes in order for them to be visible in the published view of my ePortfolio. Now that you've watched this Digication Setup tutorial, you're ready to make an ePortfolio. For more information on making an effective, easy to use, and visually compelling ePortfolio, visit depaul.digication.com slash githelp for further video tutorials, design principles, resources for finding content, and links to support documents. Mm -hmm.